take a hit some talent from from Baltimore, from Atlanta, from kind of all over for real, for real. Kind of gave a lot of people a little, a little jump start. Yeah, be smashing some of the uh, actresses so they can um, boost their career. Nah, we don't, we don't, uh, Come on, man, we don't, you gotta do this. <laughs> That's the only way. What, what, how, how the hell they get to the top? Nah, man, they get to thinking that you owe them a favor, man. You know, ain't no favors. Type shit. Respectfully. Yeah, so, uh. Man, man, fuck Yeah, I'm, I'm already knowing. I uh, Come I, in my I'll take, go describe how he'll do it. He'll be like, hey, you wanna. He was like, I'm, I'm gonna get you this part, but you gotta bend over at a 90 degree angle. Yeah. And I'm gonna just slide it in. I'm just gonna put the tip in. I'm gonna see your angles. If, I, I'm gonna see your angles. Yeah, like if it, you ain't bending over the right yeah, way, like well, we don't get that right. Do you want to be a star or not? And still, he fucking still. He like one of me. He fucking still don't give him a pause. That's like, right. bro, we filled it up. Right. Filled it you up. told me come up here at three. <laughs> you didn't have your back arched <laughs> properly, <laughs> so I had to go with the other contestant. Oh, Respect for me. <laughs> man, that's what's up, man. So you, how long you been doing that? Uh, I've been acting, acting like seven years. I've been a director probably like two years. Producer. Yeah. No. So how long how many times have you washed those pants? <laughs> Them are just you can wash but you can't dry. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I didn't know. No, I think you got a bound B. Look, oh, so air air look, I don't even know if you can wash them. I only wear them like three, four times. That's for real, nigga. Yeah. Yeah. I don't feel comfortable with washing because I feel like if I dry these motherfuckers, it ain't gonna come out the right way. Hmm. I think like when you got them joints on, like you feel like, like I don't have to use condoms. Like. Definitely, I would say that. That nigga knee look sharp as a motherfucker. Okay, like. okay, them like a twenty, right? In the way. Yeah, he like, bro. You should not be no MMA fighter. Your your knee will go through a nigga shit. And you look like you fast too. No, they run. He look like he run four flat. <laughs> and fast. them hoes though, he run four flat in them hoes. <laughs> Yeah, man, man. Man. <laughs> <laughs> it's too much level, ain't it? That light hitting that level. I ain't gonna lie, man. I'm gonna Slick, man. Keith Sweat. That's a good thing. Keith Sweat got the hoes. What? Uh, Keith Sweat do got the hoes. So what? Keith Sweat. What you doing in the directing and like recruiting actors and actresses? Like, is it somebody like real big you done turned up? Nah. I would say, you know, it take it take about five to ten years to build a real brand or a real situation, like a real situation, not like No, nah, for real. Yeah, I got motion, man, you know I got nah, nah, saying you got motion. The motion speaking for itself. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not the situation. So yeah. you know, it's all about the motion man. though, for sure. But I gave niggas a head start, you know, I gave a lot of niggas a head start. What you do with that is up to you. Type shit. Especially, especially when you're in a boosty movie. Respectfully. Yeah, okay, I'm a fucking great So you used to uh, with, with, uh, grow here on day man. Nah, nah, nah. This journey, this journey about my life story, you talking about, uh, where's MJ? Yeah, that's a comedy joint. Yeah. Like, like a, uh, like an urban thriller type of situation. Mm. Yeah. How much you charge to um produce a one? Uh, like to direct and and just you know uh, edit and everything like that, or just to direct it? Just produce and direct. It 
It depends on your budget. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna keep it real with you. Okay. Because if you got a good story, and I like the story, and I'm really fucking with the story, oh yeah, I'm gonna fuck with you. And you wanna be a part? Yeah, yeah. I might, I might, you know, sixty five hundred you. Mm -hmm. I like it. I'm fucking with you. You uh, how much you pay me to be in your joint? And he get a percentage too. <laughs> You got to tell them. You know, the type of role, depending on the type of role you get. How long you in the scene. How many things you said. I want to be a porn star. I don't write them jokes. I don't write them jokes. Yeah, I don't think you got enough meat for that. Right. You know, they like stuff on camera like that don't usually, they don't usually see. Like 12 inches. <laughs> like 12 inches. Mm. That's yeah, more too heavy. I feel like to be a porn star, you gotta be a certain type of a certain type of motherfucker to be a porn star. You gotta, you gotta not care about a lot, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, type they shit. never gonna go nowhere like those videos. Yeah. You know I know this girl. Type shit. They never gonna go nowhere it's like that. And then like, have your kids, change your life. Type shit. Yeah. If you just don't remember star, you as that. Respectfully. Facts. So good. Yeah, because Cherokee, I don't think she can work at no other job but that one. Yeah, she can't. Like, what if she apply for Applebee's? Like, Who that? Cherokee, the yeah. porn star? I don't know. You know, he know nothing. You don't watch porn? You, you've never watched porn? I can't say I've never watched porn. You you, you subscribe to OnlyFans? Nah, I don't want to get in any type of situation. Dude. Type shit, you just get unlimited pussy. <laughs> That would just seem like if you don't watch that shit. Nah, you know, uh, like I said, it ain't the clothes that the nigga in them. So for some, for some people, you know, they don't got no problem with that type of situation. Type shit. Yeah. Are you African? Nah. Um, a lot of motherfuckers be asking me. Uh, I don't know. I just feel like you go down the street like, ah, like that. Your mind go on. Your mind tripping. <laughs> Shoot dots in me for this shit. What's the damn thing? He could have easily played a role in Black Panther. Yeah, no, for sure. Black uh, 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 Blood Diamond? Yeah. Okay. Respectfully. You, you know, <clears throat> like, I ain't really listening to too many different niggas right now, but like, this one nigga I be listening to constantly, like, I fuck with do music hard. And I think you from Memphis. Ain't you from Memphis? I think the nigga is from Memphis. Eddie Valero. They go crazy. Yo, you look like him. Hell no. No? I ain't heard that one. I think it's probably with the ski mask on for real, for real. Because every time I see one of these jokes, I be like, yo, it's like, what? I just want to flex and go. Like, that was yeah. big. So, so how was your experience at the PD parties? Uh, you know, usually I don't, I don't indulge in uh, activities of that caliber because, you know, people people end up uh, doing things they they regret. Like right, wearing leather pants. <laughs> Take that. Bro, that man said we ain't going nowhere. No way. <laughs> we ain't. Going nowhere. So, so like with the acting and shit, like, do it be hard to recruit people? Nah, hell no. Hell no, not around these motherfuckers. You got so many people trying to build a resume. Build their resumes, so uh, there's plenty of people. But finding good people, quality, good quality. Yeah, no, nah, that's. I can, I can just imagine how much like Denzel Washington be charging and shit. Like, <laughs> he the goat. I think he like twenty a movie. Man. Ooh. 20 million, yeah. No, 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 no. Yeah, 20 million. I was going to say 20 million. Yeah, 20 million a movie. Like, right? look. What if he was getting paid $20,000 a movie? That'd be... That'd be, that'd be, that'd be, that'd be That's crazy. So, so like, how you feel about if you got a girl and she playing in the movie and she kissing niggas and shit? Oh no! Nah, can you do, uh, can you deal with that? Nah, not even sure. Before the kissing niggas, I don't even deal with women in my uh 
in my uh, uh, in my field. Yeah. So if I'm dealing with a woman, you know, it's you. Would you know. like big booty women, petite? What you like? I like big jiggly booty. It depends on the situation. I like I like a good personality. Yeah, that's bullshit. Respect for me. Personality just be cool and shit, but. Cause it be like it be like you could look good. You could be a fucking ten. Your, your, your ass could be fat, your face could be pretty, your waist could be slim. But if your personality like off, you gonna throw me off for real. I feel that. Yeah, you, know. yeah, you do gotta have a little sense of humor. Yeah, a little something going on. Yeah. And you gotta smell good too. Respectfully. Yeah. Is that what y'all be saying in Baltimore, respectfully? Oh, no, I see. That's something you be doing? Yeah, I'm like, I'm like, you know, like, bounced around a little bit. See, I kind of grew up in New York, Far Rockaway, Queens. Oh, uh, yeah, I, um, I'm from there. Yeah. Uh, I, um, I was there for, well, how many years I was there with? About two years? Yeah. 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 <laughs> I had to leave, though, because I was, I was getting too much money. Uh, yeah, you was getting too much? Yeah, yeah, I was. I was like, what, the number one drug dealer in, in New York? Damn. Yeah, I had to leave because I was getting way too much money. You know? It fooled me out there. I love it. I had so many Timberlands. It was crazy. So I didn't think that's like, uh, mm -hmm. you know Timberlands and, and bubble coats. But nah, funny thing though. My uh my grandfather, my, see my people's from New York too though. Mm -hmm. So like. I kind of bounced back and forth between New York and Baltimore my whole life. But like, you ever see Payton Fool? Yeah. 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 You know, like the store there in front of that red store? That's my grandfather's store. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's that is crazy. That's insane. That is crazy. That's insane. Damn. So everybody be taking pictures in front of the hell, don't they? And it's gone. Damn. That's crazy. When did it go away? They made the movie about the 80s, so that store was existing uh, in the 80s. How old are you? I'm 27. 27? Yeah. That's what's up, bro. How old are you? I ain't 32. Oh, yeah? Type shit. Type shit. Yeah. So what, so what you can say, like, what you, what will make you happy, like, from a woman? From a woman? Yeah, like, what, what all you need from a woman? Cause you know women need about thirty things from us. Yeah, I don't, I don't need nothing from a woman. No, you but, I mean, other than the the, the the normal simplicity things, you know. Yeah. Be yes. around. You know, make it make your own bread. Mm -hmm. you know, don't don't be expecting. What do you you believe in turning a woman up? Oh yeah, respectfully. What if you turn a woman up and she leave you? Um. That's just that, man. Turn it off, she left. She gonna have to give me a Rolex, because I want my time, bro. <laughs> so. Yeah, I ain't, I ain't gonna hold you. It is a risky situation, but... See, me, I'm the type of nigga to where it's though, like... It ain't even just women, like, if you my man, I'm gonna turn you up, too. It ain't, you know. Time shit. You be doing, like, chest workouts? Uh, I try to get to them every time, I, you know. Look like somebody like pumped your chest up. <laughs> Y'all ordering yeah, some food? Like yeah. What y'all getting? I know you want some pizza. Yeah, I'll take the yeah, pizza. Yeah, I just got some pizza. Was it crazy? Mm -hmm. Shit was a wild little situation. It was a, uh, mm -hmm. she called a uh, Jamaican jerk pizza. Mm -hmm. She got uh, jerk chicken on it. Damn. Uh, and it's made with the jerk sauce. And I should have bummed that shit up here. I know y'all was going to have a microwave. I swear to bum that bitch up. Damn. That's Pressure crazy. Pressure shit. Tacos. Mm -hmm. Ta mm. You can't beat tacos. From where? Make some chicken tacos. Uh, they got some else on the menu. Yeah, I'm I'm so damn picky. I'm plain, you know. I like you know. I like chicken tenders. Like, I go to five star restaurants to get tenders and shit. Yeah. Yeah. See, it depends. <clears throat> See, I'm allergic to a lot of shit, so I just can't be just trying shit like y'all. Uh, I'm allergic to shellfish and shit, crabs, all that bullshit. So every time you go out to eat, you be scared. Type shit. For 
for real. I be like, damn. Like, I, I fucked around and got, like, they had mixed the shrimp up, and I had ate it. I had some shrimp juice in it. I look like hit trying this hoe. Like, that shit crazy. I don't fuck with it. So what, uh, do you ever think about quitting? No. Nah. That's good. You said no nah, hard. Like, you, you just brushed your teeth before you came up here. Yeah, you said, nah, respectfully. I did. Nah, I hit these motherfuckers before I came. Nah, that, that ain't even a joke. Respectfully. But nah, yeah, man. Fuck no, nah, I don't ever think about quitting. That's like the... It's like one... I can't even see the last thing in my mind. What kind of haircut you got up under that head? Ball. Let me see. Man, you like tank. <laughs> Please don't go. <laughs> what's, the, yes, what, what's the craziest thing you you seen on set? Man. Yeah, um, what's the what's what's the craziest thing you seen on on the set before? On set, ah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Fuck, it depend on who set you on, man. Let, let me ask you this before we get to it. You remember uh, the, the show Insecure, right? Nah. You've never seen Insecure? Nah. Wow. But they look like they was fucking on their jump. Like, do they really be fucking in some of them jumps? Or did that shit just be, it be an angle? <laughs> nah, that would be an angle. Okay, I was gonna say, man. They made that shit look so real. Yeah, that should be an angle. It's just, it's just how far, how far an actor and an actress willing to go with the angles. See what I'm saying? Nigga might go as far as putting a joint in his sock and there's nothing else on. Some niggas might be cool with that, some niggas might not. A female might be cool with nipple pasties and makeup or, see what I'm saying? Nothing else on, whatever the case may be. Just depending on what the situation is. That'd be crazy. And you just see it, just female just getting smacked. Yeah, that's why I couldn't date no actress. That'd be a, uh, that'd be a, a crazy thing, man. Yeah, cause they they want motherfucker to do just anything. Yeah, yeah, I gotta I gotta watch that. My favorite movie. <laughs> you gotta keep saying that. Keep you. saying that, nah. Yeah, that'll piss a nigga off for real. And yeah. I I watch the scene, and you come back to the bed. Oh, babe, you want some? Nah, I don't want nothing. <laughs> Respectfully, get away from me. <laughs> All right, go, go tell that nigga, go get that nigga something. <laughs> go get that nigga right, something. Man. It was just a movie. <laughs> Fuck that. Could you date an OnlyFans? Nah, hell no. I couldn't date an OnlyFans. I couldn't date a stripper. I love strippers, but I couldn't date a stripper. You know. Yeah, it's just like you know. Me you know it is, you know, type shit. Type shit. Would you subscribe though? Nah, I feel like I feel like I feel like that's a waste of money. Yeah. You no. Know. Well, it depends. If I got seven dollars, I fuck with it for a month. Seven dollars is crazy. If if uh, if that's their monthly fee, I'm gonna be wondering what's going on on that motherfucker anyway. Seven dollars. Hey, you know, man, man, it's some freaks out here, man. You ain't lying. But you know, usually, like, you get what you pay for with shit. Mm-hmm. Like, when I came up here, I was like, damn, check that. Man, they got this bitch put together a little balcony. I'm like, I, I feel like you kind of get what you pay for in a situation. So, seven dollars is like. Type shit. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm ready to, you know. Yeah. So, like, let me ask you this. Could you date a female? She was a hoe in one city, but she came to a new city. It's already over with. <laughs> it's already over with. I'm saying you don't know though. Um, you gonna know? Yeah, you is. Yeah, any because there ain't no bitch just cold in the bedroom and just only fuck two niggas. So. Nah, nah. This is before we hit the bedroom, it's other things you gonna do beforehand. There's a lot of other tendencies that uh. How that, you how you know a girl is a hoe? See, you don't know until you see it. I'm saying, what, start what doing do you, certain shit, what you, you like, see? Oh, oh, I didn't even know you was. You be. Oh, I didn't even know that. Yeah, that's how that shit be going. Type shit. 
Like, what you, what you, when you, like, when you, when you see, when you see a female, you like, and you, you know, on a date, whatever, whatever the case may be, what type of thing she do that you be like, oh, nah, I ain't fucking with that. I ain't want to build together. What you mean? You know how they say to build separate or together, like, you gotta go separate. We moving too fast. <laughs> You got to pay for our own shit. Yeah, because we just get, because it's my thing. Females say we're moving too fast when we want to fuck. So we're moving too fast on the field. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 I'm like, you got to take that one. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> yeah. like, you think I'm a hoe, bitch? You think I'm a trick? The fuck? Yeah. 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 We're getting to know each other. <laughs> Real talk. Because cause it's, it, it, it's just like women. I'm gonna tell you this what's fucked up. Is a female will test a broke nigga pockets. Oh yeah. But a nigga with some money, they'll fuck around and pay for it. That shit crazy. Yeah, you ain't lying. Yeah, we got money, you don't gotta pay for it. That's crazy. crazy. See, I feel like I feel like when you when you just got the like I feel like it's a gift of God, you know, that 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 just come with just come with this shit, you know, like I'm like, I done been dead beat both. Yeah, it's demeanor. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's your demeanor. You know what I'm saying? Because this girl might do something for me that she might not do for you. Respect This girl me. might do something for you, but it's just demeanor. And you got less than I got and everything, but she doing all of that for you. Yeah, it's it don't really matter. Matter. <laughs> I'm talking about spending their last, too. I'm trying to tell you. I seen a nigga have a conversation one time. Dude, they were fucking the same girl, and he was just like, bro. How you fuck you? I fucked him. And he said, that's crazy, bro. She don't suck dick. He's like, what? She was damn lie. He said she sucked the lie down on my dick. He's like, bro, <laughs> you a lie? That's the first thing she did. That's crazy. So it, it's different niggas, different shit. Nah, that's nah, all this nah, shit. Nah, for real, though. Like, yeah. He, the nigga that was probably getting chewed up was probably paying for more shit. Any pipe when I'm thinking about no, that like that. Gotta, no, 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 never think money, money don't mean shit, bro. I'm trying to tell you. This is the nigga. I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> nigga, right, if you that nigga, you really ain't got to spend no money. Man. Yeah, you only got to have money. <laughs> There's some niggas out here that really be pimping fool like without like women pimping. women got it's a right thing food. like certain niggas can get away with shit and certain niggas can't and you need to find out what nigga you is. <laughs> <laughs> but niggas be doing shit that they ain't even qualified for that talking shit. and moving that's that. why bitches be like girl who <laughs> <laughs> the fuck <laughs> they is that that shit going on that is for real. I'm, yeah, see yeah. me, I'm, you know what I'm saying, like, that grass ain't green on the other side. I tell a bitch, ain't no upgrade after me. Gotta let that hoe go see what the grass is. Oh, God, ain't no upgrade yeah. after me. Oh, for who you going to? <laughs> I'm gonna get money for real. <laughs> I don't care. Man, it's up. <laughs> Yo, look, though, what's the, um, what's the hardest thing y'all be, y'all be facing with, uh, we're stepping up to the to the next level with uh the whole podcast and Jack. Well you know I've been I've been waiting for a minute, so I just be with the, the question that you ask is like what will we face to get to the next level? Yeah. I mean shit, you gon when you dealing with this shit, bro, you gotta understand this there's a lot of other people doing this. Respectfully. So you gotta know what type of person you is in the world. I'm a type of person, I gotta work hard as fuck to get something. Other people don't. Like what? You see what I'm saying? So they might do something one time. I gotta do it 20 times to do it for to get that one time. They get, that's cool though. You know what's crazy? When you, if you ain't nobody else around you like that, you think, you think, it'll be time to just get to thinking life being hard on you, but it ain't. Not for sure. You just gotta it go ain't. back to your notes. Real talk. You know what I'm saying? Realize like, hey, that's it, crazy. It's gonna come hard for me, bro. It is what it is. And I don't give it. And I don't give a Real fuck talk. what people think. You know what I'm saying? You just gotta wake up earlier than everybody else. It is what it is. You know what I'm saying? I heard that. That's crazy. You said that. Yeah. We're going. You, you ever like woke 
like be waking up sometimes at like four in the morning, like just Every randomly. Day. I be feeling like that's a sign to do something. Like yeah, I, I write. At I be waking up at four in the morning. I just start editing videos or some shit. Yeah. Or like that's the time to do. That's that. That's that creative time. That's that. That's that. That time you're gonna create some shit that you're not gonna create when the sun is up or when it's only twelve o'clock or eleven o'clock. It ain't gonna come there. What's the earliest you ever woke up to like dry your pants? <laughs> <laughs> no, folks. <laughs>